I want to know, like, um, when you were cast, tell me about that journey and experience. Well, I, I was like, why are we doing re Color Purple again? That's just dumb. And then... <laughs> <laughs> but it was when Blitz called and said and told me about um, his radical vision, yeah. reimagining of it, and I was like, oh, my God, <clears throat> I have to be in this. And not only that, I mean, this is the first time that the, we own our narrative of mm -hmm. this incredible poem, like mm -hmm. Corey likes to say, that Alice Walker left with us. And so, um, I mean, I was like, oh my God, well, you mean we find joy in this one? Yeah. Because yeah. that's who we are? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I'm in. <laughs> and you play Shook. Yeah. I had big shoes to I dedicated I my head to Shook today. <laughs> Nervous. I was incredibly intimidated. I had big shoes to fill, oh, and goodness. then I'm gotta go sing with uh, with Tasia over here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> she did. Sing down. Thank oh, you. Goodness. Okay, tell them who you play, Tasia. Okay, so I play Miss Seeley. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. And Jay, you know, at first when they called, I said, I don't, I don't think I can do it. Yeah? Yeah. Because, you know, I played Celie twice on Broadway. Mm -hmm. I was much younger. Yes, you did. And playing her then, my life was a little crazy, so I felt like I was carrying my cross and her cross, mm -hmm. and that was heavy. Um, but, again, Blitz called me and showed me that he was giving Celie an imagination. And that's when I said I'm in. Because from the Broadway play and the movie, you have to almost think about what Celie's thinking about or how she's gonna get, but this movie shows you how she makes it through some of her things, and that's, that's how we are. Yes. When we going through stuff, we imagine ourselves in a better place. Mm. When we get a little broke, we imagine ourselves with some smile. Yes. Okay, Danny, listen, I haven't seen Jay. you since Color Purple. <laughs> I am so proud of you. I'm so proud of you. Oh my goodness, and you played Miss Sophie. You already know. <laughs> I know, now that I know. <laughs> What was it like bringing it to the screen oh my from the gosh. stage? First of all, I had an incredible time doing that with you for a full year yeah. of our mm -hmm. lives. Yes, you know, with you too. so amazing. Thank you for that opportunity, that Oprah. 15. But to get the call from the one and only, the goat of all goats, y'all, <laughs> Miss Oprah Winfrey, <laughs> making the call and passing I the did. baton. I did the call. Yes, that's you know you the goat of all goats, <laughs> um, which Thank means you. the greatest of all time. That's right. That. Um, but yes, it was an incredible moment, one I will never forget. I felt in that moment that I knew my life was about to change mm. playing this part and artistically as an actress. So, getting to play Sophia has been such a joy. Getting to do it from the theater now to film for the whole world to experience yes. all of these characters and this story in this way. It is time. It is the time right now for this story to be shared with you all. And, and you guys are telling it. Yes, you are. And Felicia, Felicia this is, yeah. like, first of all, congratulations to you because this, I mean, you've sent the people to all these icons. Yeah. And this, <laughs> You remind me of me and Dreamgirl, so I kind of feel like I understand you, but I want to hear from you. How does it feel? How did you feel when you got the call, and what has this experience been for you? Well, unlike them, they told me no at first. Because <laughs> <laughs> really? I auditioned to play older Celie at first, um, and they just came back and said, do you not understand you read very young? You're mm. young. And I was like, but makeup, right? You can figure it out. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> um, and then I just released it. I was working in a writer's room at the time when I was going through the process, and I remember my team kind of did a group chat where I was like, are you free? And I was on Zoom and I was like, I need to go to the bathroom, do you mind? I'll be right back. And then left and got a call and the words that I was told was you were the choice. Mm. And it felt so good to be choice, oh, chosen by people. Yeah. Like, oh my God. Oprah. Yeah. You are the choice. Yes. If you like this video, smash that like button and subscribe to the Jennifer Hudson Show YouTube channel. Check your local listings or visit JenniferHudsonShow.com to see when you can watch full episodes in your area. And don't forget to sign up for the newsletter.